Dear Muji, I follow your indications and they brought me specifically beautiful moments, but none of them was full recognition. I am putting in front of me fundamental questions whenever I feel lost in my satsang or have some kind of fear or feeling of powerlessness. I am relaxing and trying to keep it simple and find that simplicity as I, finally. Even so, this inquiry appears to be increasingly difficult. There is a tiredness arising and I'm losing power of concentration on that consciousness of only the pure existence. I'm ending in the state of semi-consciousness like in a dream. I know that there is something aware of all this, aware of all of that, but I can't recognize that fully and be consciously free. Please tell me what is missing. Thank you very much, Muji. Alexandra in Poland. I am putting in front of me fundamental questions. Whenever I feel lost in my satsang or have some clear kind of fear, some fear or feelings of powerlessness. I am relaxing and trying to keep it simple and find that simplicity as I finally. Even so, this inquiry appear, appears to be increasingly difficult. Now let's see why. There is tiredness arising and I am losing power of concentrating on that consciousness of the pure existence. There is still the mind and too much effort trying to do something, trying to be something, but you say there is tiredness arising. That tiredness is observed and I am losing power of concentration even. Then you may, you may look at, okay, um, this power, losing power of concentration is also observed. Uh, I'm not able to concentrate on that consciousness of the pure existence. The pure, ob the pure existence is not a phenomenon that you can fix your consciousness upon. The pure existence is already the space in which efforts are being observed to be made. And that when you that uh, that feeling of iness, the pure unassociated iness, if you can say, is itself not making any any effort. It is the one looking in the mirror of inquiry and seeing the reflection of itself there. It knows the reflection is not it, but it knows that the reflection cannot be there without itself. The reflection only reminds it that there is nothing else that you are seeing but yourself. This is what the reflection is there. I am ending in the state of semi-consciousness. Semi-consciousness is also seen. Like a dream. Dream is also seen. I know there is something aware of all of that. Yeah, it's you. You are aware of all of that. But the one who is making the effort, you are identifying with this thing, making the effort, but making effort is also seen. But you are identifying with the one making the effort, and, and, and the one who is feeling the frustration of too much effort. And so then you are not able to say, you can only say, I am aware uh, of something that is greater than this. How did you put it? I know there is something aware of all of that. But I cannot recognize that fully. This I is which I? Which I? This I is the mental I, which is still somehow shape-shifting, going to different degrees of identification with the body-mind, sometimes as consciousness, sometimes swinging out again as body-mind and so on. Not stable. But instead of holding that inside the inquiry still, identification is arising with this I out of habit, and then it seems like the pure awareness, which is really what you are, seems like I can't fix my attention on that awareness. Because that I, which is the false I, can only phenomenalize awareness, which is inaccurate because there is no image of awareness, you see. I know there is something aware of all of that, but I can't recognize that fully and be consciously free. The minute you recognize that fully, that I cannot stay divided, then that I is sucked in 
and you are that which you are observing, then then that one uh, there is no duality there. So tell me what is missing. Well, actually, nothing was missing. It's just the correct understanding that will help you to judge your true uh, perspective. That you can say was missing. You see, but in actual fact, essentially, nothing is missing. Something is felt to be missing because of a, um, uh, a distraction. Very good, Alexandra. <laughs>